Đùa nè Đùa rồi, đùa rồi Oh my gosh, Hello teacher. Yay. Hello teacher. Oh. Yes, so clever. What is? I was just messaging the school. I'm just saying, hello, my student. Oh, I can't even show you that. Hello, my student is struggling with her camera. Da 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 da. da. Anyways, I'm so glad you got back. Let me put this in. How did you do that? I closed the computer and. Open again. Teacher. All right, there we go. Okay. okay ask you for a second i think your internet's also a little bit volatile which is what's happening what are you doing it's good my internet okay. good oh okay perfect all right let's oh learn 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 let's go let's go let's go let's go let's get started okay start Page one. Okay, so you are going to read a long text for me. We're going to start with a comprehension about my family. All right, can you start with family life? Wait. Okay. Family life play an important part in most people's life. Whether life, life whether positive negative big or small the kind of family we are a part of will affect our life very good joe and matter met last week in class is their first time hanging out and they getting to know each other and taking about family. Joe, so where does your family come from? Mother, well, my dad said of the family is from Indiana and my Mom say of the family is from California. My parents met at college in Florida. Talk. So that's where I grew up. Joe, so do you see your extended family a lot then? Very good. Okay, next part. Mother, not really. My family is small and I don't have a lot of living relatives relative left anymore. Actually, I just have one aunt in California and my grandpa in Indiana. I see them maybe one once a year. Joe, mm -hmm. I guess it is kind of far to travel to the state reverently. Do you have a, a lot of sip links? The bling, Mata, no. Actually, I'm an only child. Joe, your family is pretty small then. So, it's just your, just you, your mom, and your dad, basically. Mata, well, yes. I have a picture of you us 
do you yes. want to say is? Joe, sir. Sure. Very good. Amazing. Okay, what does Martha say next? Martha, that's me with my family on vacation last year. Joe, you really take after your mom. You look like sister. Martha, I know. Everyone says we look alike. Mm -hmm. What about you? Do you have a big family? Yo, yeah. I have a really big family. They all li live in Florida. So yeah. I have six aunts, five uncles, maybe 20 cousins, and two sets of grand grandparents nearby. Nearby? Nearby. Matha does so like a lot. Joe, is it plus? I have seven siblings, two sister, and five brother. Nice. Well done. Amazing. You read beautifully. Okay. Oh, sorry. Oh my gosh. There's so much. <laughs> okay. Let's read. <laughs> sorry. Go ahead. Your parents had eight children. That's so many. Joe, mm -hmm. I know our house is crazy. I'm the oldest and I always have to babysit. Matter how old are your siblings? Joe, let's see, they are 20, 20, 18, 14, 10, 8, 4, and 1, and a yes, half. Yes. Matter, mm -hmm. wow. That's a pretty big apprent. Joe, I know a drink. Joe, I know it's a nurse. Oh, my parents just have love having kids, I guess. Matter, so do you see your family often? Joe, yes. They live about 10 minutes from my apartment. I see them almost every week, weekend. I see my extended family about once a month too. Very good. Okay, last page now. Sorry. Sorry, Quinn. <laughs> last page. <laughs> you died. You need water. Mata, that's must be so nice to have such a big family close by. Joe, is it? It is. It can be a little hurt sometimes, but it's nice to know that there are so many people who can help you out in if you need it. Mata, mm -hmm. that's so different from what I'm used to. Joe, you should come over for dinner at our house on Sunday. They love to meet my friends. Mata, sure, that'd be fun. Joe, okay, let me tell my mom and I. I asked her what that will be good and let you know. Mata, so good. Wow, you read so much now. Oh my gosh. Whew, take a break. <laughs> okay, so they are talking about families. Do you come from a big family or small family? My family have six. Six people? Who's in your immediate family? So mom, dad, you, who else? My baby brother. Okay, grand, how old is he? Grandpa and grandma. My baby oh, brother okay. is six years old. Oh, I see. Okay, I have you... many, many uncle, Many, many oh. aunts and... 
six cousins. Wow, six cousins? Yes. Okay. Do, in do you have a Bingfu. Oh, wow. And do you have a favorite cousin? Is there one cousin that is your favorite? Yes. Who? What is their name? Is she, she's named Hin. Hin? Yes. Okay, why is she your favorite cousin? Because she, she is very, very happy to me and my baby brother. Oh, very nice. How old is she? She 11 years old. Oh, okay. How old are you now, Quinn? Eight. Eight. Oh, years. okay. So she's a big cousin. Oh, cool. Very nice. Okay, now there are two different kinds of families. So the family that lives with you, the family that you lived with, so the first group that you described, mom, dad, your baby brother, granny and grandpa, that is your nuclear family. They live with you. I say immediate. I prefer the word immediate, but you can also use the word nuclear. Your extended family is everyone else you just explained aunties, uncles, cousins, everyone that's extended. So that would be your family, a big family. Lots of aunties and lots of uncles. How many aunties have you got? Hmm. So many, I don't count it. Oh. Okay, do you have a favorite auntie? Is there one auntie that you like the most? Aunt, aunt, or uh, uncle. Yeah, is there, is there an auntie or an uncle that you like the most? Who's your favorite? My uncle. Okay, what's his name? His name Young. Okay, and why do you like Young? Because he is also happy to me and baby brother and also, also play with me. Oh, very nice. What does he play? Hi and seek. Oh, cute. That's so sweet. <laughs> Very nice. Where does he hide? Do you know where his hiding spots are now? He hide, he hide in the bedroom. Oh, okay. So you know his tricks now. Okay. Okay. I've already asked you this. Who are your favorite? Okay. I've asked you that. What do you think? I've already asked you some of these questions just out of my own. Now, number four. What do you think would be an advantage, so a good thing, um, to being an only child? So if you didn't have your baby brother, what would be an advantage to that, a good thing about that? So why would, no. would you? Okay, say again, I missed that. I don't know this work and this work. Okay, so advantage is like positive reasons. A disadvantage would be like negative reasons. So for instance, um, an advantage to being an only child would be, so let's think, what are the good things about being an only child? Some of the good things might include the fact that you get more presents at Christmas time, or you get more presents on your birthday because you don't have to share with your brother. Um, another advantage, you get more attention. That would be the good thing. So what would be some of the good things about being an only child? Hmm. Hmm. Or let's think, maybe it's easier to think of disadvantages. What would be some of the disadvantages? Um, let's I... So disadvantage, you might get lonely. There's nobody around. You don't have any body to talk to you might get lonely okay uh, now let's look at can you think of anything else 
I play with uh, mm -hmm. only uh, Yeah, I'll say. Okay, you got someone to play with. Very good. Yes. I right. play with my baby brother. All right, yes, you have somebody to play with. Perfect idea, perfect example. All right, now number five. Let's go straight to number five. How important is it to you to see your parents and reg relatives regularly after leaving home? So one day when you're older, when you're a grown up, is it still going to be important for you to see mom and dad if you don't live with them? important like um let me go to google translate let's go there google translate it's across these across important there we go one chunk one chunk can you translate so is it, this this sentence? Oh, how important is it to see your parents? How important is it to you to still see your parents after you oopsie, after you leave home? when you're older. Quan trọng như thế nào đối với bạn khi bạn vẫn gặp cha mẹ sau khi bạn rời khỏi nhà khi bạn lớn hơn? I very I very very happy. Okay, so it's it, it's going to be very important to you. Is that correct? Yes, yes. very okay. very important. Okay, so even after you leave home when you're 21 or whatever you still want to see mom and dad yeah i want I to see, see my friend my friend my dad and my mom every day yes me too i see mom and dad i'm old and i still see my mom and dad every single day i don't even want to leave the country because i don't want to leave there Okay, Quinan, you did amazing. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Bye.